what's up it's me natasha and today as you can probably see right behind me or right on top of my head we are going to, to chick-fil-a but not only chick-fil-a we're also going to starbucks dunkin donuts and mcdonald's to try their holiday drinks and we are going to rate the best holiday drinks and we're going to start off with chick-fil-a Alrighty, so I got my first drink from Chick-fil-A, and it's the peppermint drink. It looks like peppermint. <laughs> um, you guys requested it on my Instagram. I got 32 votes yes and two votes no, so I think the majority of them works. Um, so we're going to try it. In the car. <laughs> yeah. Alrighty, so we're in the car now, and oh yeah, I already put the straw in. So we are going to try our drink. Definitely taste the peppermint. And then I taste some aftertaste, which is kind of a vanilla. Maybe that's the whipped cream. <laughs> Tastes pretty good. No, it's actually not that bad. Um, I would have liked one that wasn't peppermint, but since I legit ordered peppermint, I can't really argue with that. Um, on a scale of one to ten, um, I'd say it's a nine point five. <laughs> it's really good, except. I just wished y'all wouldn't have picked peppermint. But that's the only holiday drink that they have. Exactly, so. Uh. Anyways, I'm just gonna finish this and then we'll see you at the next destination. Alrighty, so as you can see, we're at Dunkin' Donuts and the winning drink that you guys voted for was the caramel macchiato, so I got hot caramel macchiato and my mom said she just wanted to try it she got the sugar plum macchiato and I got this one hot like you guys suggested and my mom got the sugar plum macchiato cold um so we're going to try this out alrighty we're going to try the hot caramel macchiato now so let's try it out I feel like it's hot <laughs> I feel like it's gonna burn my tongue. So I'm gonna blow. Okay. I'll give you some of my eyes. I'm scared. I haven't tried it yet. <laughs> That's my mom's drink. It's not like getting in. Mm, tastes like coffee, which is actually really good. A little coffee, a little bit of a sweet twist, but it's hot. So I think we're gonna try it when it cools down a bit, cause then uh, I can actually enjoy it more. And we also got these cute little donut holes. They ran out of um, the glazed donuts. So we just got the glazed little munchkins for two dollars. Ten for two dollars. Delicious. Anyways, we're gonna wait for the macchiato to cool down and my mom is gonna try her drink. Alrighty, so this is my mom's sugar plum macchiato. I'm actually gonna try it for her. So let's <laughs> Sorry, Google Maps was on it was like Turn right on blah 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 blah. <laughs> I'm like, eh? <laughs> anyways, let's try this out. Oh, so good. Wish this was mine. And then my mom also got this donut, and I'm gonna try it for her once again. You're gonna like it. So, what's your rating for this sugar plum? Okay, since it's not my drink, I'm not sure if I can necessarily rate it, but I give it a 10. Oh yeah? Better than... Uh, Maybe even 11 out of 10. Oh wow. So now it's all mixed, no more purple. 
But, yeah, that drink is delicious. We're just gonna have to wait for my drink to cool down. And then we'll try it. Who knows, maybe I'll give it a 15 out of 10 or something like that. But these donuts get a 2 million out of 10. Mm hmm yeah. <laughs> so, we unlidded the lid, or uh, took off the lid actually. I have no clue why I said unlidded. Um, and we revealed some foam, I guess. Right there. Oh, that made a super weird sound. Uh, the, the, okay. There we go. Um, I think it's cooling down a bit. Uh, so I'm just going to fix the camera and we're gonna try it. Please don't spill, okay. Mmm, this tastes good. You want a trade? Yeah, it's a trade test. I still think this one's better though. Yeah, I think that one's a 10 out of 10. This one's an 11 out of 10. This one's much more sweet, and that one tastes more like coffee. This one doesn't taste like caramel. I know, it just tastes like coffee. That's why I'm giving it a 10 out of 10, because this is better. Actually, maybe not a 10 out of 10. I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10 because I don't taste the caramel. Yeah, it's just two caramel swirl, but maybe we have to stir. Let me see. Maybe. I didn't do that. <laughs> this tastes good. No difference, even with a straw. Be careful. <laughs> I'm going to... Stir, 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 stir. Huh. Anyways, it's just an 8 out of 10, I'm gonna say. Not even a 9. Um, I would not even give it an 8. It doesn't even taste like caramel. Yeah. Maybe just a 7 then. Anyways, see what the next stop. Alrighty, so now we are indoors <laughs> instead of outdoors. We are in Albertson. Um, and there's a Starbucks right here. So we are going to order a drink. You guys chose the peppermint hit drink, but since we've already had a peppermint one at Chick-fil-A, I am going to choose the caramel brulee latte instead. Uh, so sorry guys that I kind of let you down, uh, but uh, it's right there, right behind in the menu. You can see the green drink right there. That's the caramel brulee latte, but that's the one that I want. Um, so maybe next time, if we ever do this challenge again, I'll do the peppermint hip uh, drink for you guys. Anyways, let's order. Alrighty, so we got the drinks. This is my caramel brulee latte. And this one, my mom got the eggnog frappe. And so we are about to try them next the car. Alright, T, we are in the car. In the car. <laughs> So, um, my mom got the eggnog drink, and I'm going to stop speaking inside of whatever this accent is. What accent is that? <laughs> Probably like British, right? But I can do a better impression of British. Um, so I'm going to try, I think I want to try my mom's eggnog first, because that the latte might be a bit warm. Um, I'm, this might be a bit interesting, because I'm not 100% sure what eggnog tastes like. So this is gonna be my first experience of ever tasting eggnog in my life. My nine and a half years of living. Then three quarters years of living. You tried it before, you don't remember, but. I did? Mm -hmm. I've tried eggnog. Yeah, it's a Christmas drink. It tastes good, you're gonna like it, it's sweet. You're right about the fact it tastes good and being sweet. Yeah, this is pretty good. I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10. I still think the sugar plum is better than this. Um, and either way, it's not my drink, so I don't know. I think I'm gonna have to rate my mom's drinks and my drinks, and then we'll put the winner together. So far, my mom's drink is winning. I think my mom has a good opinion, or maybe just, or maybe just, you guys don't have a good opinion. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, I, this is good. 
Yeah. I would say that sugar plum was less sweet than this. This one might be a little bit too sweet. Yeah, exactly. That's why I give it a 10, not an 11. <laughs> um, I think... Uh, warm. Uh, it's warm, but I think it might be actually too warm, so too hot, all I'm saying. Uh, so I think we're just gonna let it cool down. Yeah, cool down. For some reason, I wanted to say warm up. You know, there's a difference. Cool, warm, up, down. <laughs> cool up, warm down. That sounds wrong. <laughs> Anyways, so we're just gonna let it dry. We're gonna let it cool down, and uh, we didn't get any food this time. We usually get food, but we didn't get food since we just had a donut. Anyways, so let's just have it cool down. See, so we're at home now, and uh, we, I think our drink is cooled down. So I'm gonna try it out. So this better be good. Mm. This one has to be my favorite so far. Oh my God, that is so good. It doesn't taste as much as coffee. It tastes like caramel. Um, like I can taste a teensy, 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 teensy bit of coffee, but it tastes so good. I need more. Which one was it again? Caramel brulee. Cream brulee. Wait, what is it? It's trade. Trade. I already tried this eggnog one, but. Mm. So Starbucks is the winner in this? Well, not yet. I can't declare that because we haven't gone to McDonald's. What if McDonald's is better? Which one? What's your rating? Oh, so good. I'm gonna have to give it a. Better than the. Better than the sugar plum, yeah, because it's not as sweet as the sugar plum, which I like. Let me try again. Mm. Not that this one isn't good, but. Yeah, agreeable. This one, um, I like it, but I'm cold. <laughs> yeah, same. Like, this is nice and warm. Nice little. Just so, out of these two, yours is winning? Yeah, what do you think? Mm -hmm. Yeah, because that one's too sweet. Like, I think this one beats the one at Dunkin', so I'm gonna have to give it a 12 out of 10. Um, um, also, I have to change the one for the caramel macchiato at Dunkin', because I can't really say that one was the best, so I'm gonna give it a five instead of an eight. Remove three points really quick, um, because it was not really good. It just tasted like coffee. I, I, I think had this one you can give it an eight, I think. Yeah, this one I'm gonna give an eight, but the caramel macchiato over there, Duncan. Yeah, that's that one was. Do, do, do. And then the one Definitely not from the one. Chick Fil A was even that though we don't like peppermint, it was pretty good. Yeah, that got all the credit because because we can't take off a point because we chose the peppermint flavor. So technically, it's since it's really good, I give it a nine point five. Or did I give it a nine? Or did I give it? But also like peppermint, it was really good. Yeah, besides the fact that it was peppermint, it was really, really, really good. But this one has to be my favorite. Yeah, that one was refreshing. But this one has to be my favorite because it's nice and warm, which fits the nice little Christmas mood. Because you know you like to drink hot cocoa. Definitely gonna keep this on my list when we're going to watch my show, uh, my dance show. <laughs> um. Mmm. Oh, it tastes so good. So this one, once again, is gonna get a 12 out of 10. If I even said that. Did I even say that once again? Um. Anyways, see you at McDonald's, but we're gonna do that tomorrow because it's dark. Alrighty guys, we just went to McDonald's, as you can see right here. I'm doing some advertising. No, I'm kidding, I'm not gonna pay for any of these. Not sponsored. <laughs> um. So, we. I got the hot cocoa and there's a little drizzle of whipped cream and chocolate which makes it look pretty appetizing i mean who doesn't like chocolate there it is sounds busy close the light bulb. okay now and then okay, my mom my mom she also got okay. almost the same thing except it's just the peppermint flavor we're just going to wait for it to cool down because right now it's... For me, it's peppermint mocha. Yeah. It's a coffee. Oh, okay. So it's mo... Hers is a coffee. It might be hot. 
the peppermint tea. <laughs> Again, you know, not a fan of peppermint. peppermint. But that was the only holiday drink that they had. Besides hot cocoa and some other stuff. But like special, you know? like Yeah, it was like so. mainly on the list for a limited time. What do you mean by special? Okay, you wanna try it? Yeah, it tastes the peppermint. It tastes really good actually. It gives me a nice feeling down my throat. Oh, that feels good. Um, now I just have to try my own hot cocoa. That is so good. Mmm! Oh my god, this one has to be my favorite. So that's your favorite of all? The one you tried? Or the drink you tried? So I may like the Starbucks one better. <laughs> I'm not sure, I'm kind of debating, I don't know. Oh my god, this is so good. Also, it also tastes like the ones that my elf, my elves gave me. My elf, my elves gave me. So I think for me, my favorite was the Duncan Sugar Plum. Sugar Plum. My number two was um, Starbucks Eggnog. Number three. And then I will say I'll go for this number three. And then number four. Only had three because you know at well she kind of shared the peppermint. Yeah, drink. it was good. Um, maybe I would say that the Chick Fil A is probably better than the McDonald's one. Yeah, we don't really. It like was like really fresh, but it was also a cold one. So, but <sighs> that's my pick. And your turn, Gosha. I'm still debating, Mc McDonald's or or um what was the other one? McDonald's or Starbucks or Chick-fil-A? No, Chick-fil-A was a 9.5. Uh, I gave I gave the Starbucks one a 12. This one's really good. I have no clue. Oh, I yesterday's think I would give was Starbucks so good. because this is just like a regular hot yeah, chocolate. I definitely am gonna choose Starbucks now. I think because this is just regular hot chocolate. But after Starbucks, it's gonna be this one. This one gets me in the Christmas spirit too. Because okay. since one is hot cocoa, not a jolly drink. Okay, and then the next one has to be Chick-fil-A because my last, my <laughs> is Dunkin' Donuts. No offense, Dunkin' Donuts, if you're watching this. But they're caramel. The caramel, I don't taste it. So if Dunkin' Donuts, you're watching this, I doubt, but um, if you're watching this, please add, Please work on adding more caramel to your coffee. But yeah. All right, Tay. So we also got a cinnamon bun, um, and that is going to be pretty tasty. It comes in a, in a little box. Like yes. a hamburger. <laughs> like a hamburger. Oh my god, that's gonna be sweet. <gasps> that's gonna be so yummy. It, it feels nice and warm right now. Good so thing gonna... that you played two hours of tennis this morning. <laughs> I'm gonna gain all the calories back that I burnt. I'm just kinda sad, but who cares? It's worth it. It's a cinnamon bun. Um, so we're gonna Is let it, it cool down. It's warm, feel it. <laughs> oh, so that's why it took so long to get it. It didn't take so long. Get it? I'm gonna have him on my nose. <laughs> <laughs> my mom, she just took a bite and now I think she <laughs> she has them on her lip. Mmm. Mm. Too sweet for me. <laughs> She's calling a cinnamon bun too sweet? Excuse me? <laughs> Is that a European thing? Yes. I'll stick to my coffee. <gasps> it looks like I just got. So, oh, which one was your favorite glass. treat? This mm -hmm. or Dunkin' Donuts or this or no? Remember Chick Fil A? We got a burger. Oh yeah, but that's, but that's not, not a sweet treat. Oh, I love cinnamon buns, but I love donuts. So this is such a hard decision. Hmm. I have some on my nose, do I? So. 
Which one? I have no clue. I love cinnamon buns. And you know, since Duncan took the L for last place, but since McDonald's took the second place instead of first, I don't know. You know, I want to give a, an opportunity to both. It's a tie. Hmm. I don't want to make it a tie because then it'll be like, oh, who won? Uh, hmm. I'm going to have to say the cinnamon bun is the winner. It's nice and sweet. And it's it's bigger too because I only had the donut holes. Um, but, but Dunkin' Donuts was really good. I give that a 10 out of 10. These I just give a 10.5 I think both are $2. I think the other one was $2 for 10 and this one I think it's also $2 for that. Big chungus. So you got a lot for your money. Hmm? You got a lot of food for your money, a lot of sugar. For only two bucks. Nice deal. Mmm, <laughs> delicious. Okay, this one, 10.5. Donuts, 10. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. If you did, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button. Also, don't forget to subscribe. The button looks like this. Also, let's do this thing. Again, I think it's gonna be a traditional thing for each video. Like if you celebrate Hanukkah, subscribe if you celebrate Christmas, and do both if you celebrate both, none, or Kwanzaa. <laughs> Bye guys, love you. See you on the next episode of Vlogmas with Natasha.